Hello, Times Cryptic, let's go. Just like one mimicking say, Renoir in cinema, early on. Nope. Nobody being in touch is concerning. Nope. Crimes suffering being invaded by hard monster. Crimea suffering in being invaded by hard monster. So I think suffering is an anagram indicator for Crimea and hard is H, the abbreviation. So I think we're looking for an anagram of Crimea and H and that gives Chimera, which is a monster. Chaps tax-free savings account. I think this is Isaac. Chap is a reference to just a man's name, which Isaac is. And a tax-free savings account in the UK could be an ISA account. Closest human, perhaps. Circling bull. Nope. One of two... I encountered in upper atmosphere. Nope. Kuwait's capital. Arabs are changing. Old settlement. I think Kuwait's capital is a reference to the initial letter of Kuwait, K. Changing could therefore be an anagram indicator for K, Arabs and R. Old could be O. So, with all that said, is there a settlement with those letters? Arabs are with OK. Nope, not that I can see. Nothing being in touch is concerning. Yes, this is about, so nothing is O. Being in touch, being in a but. That gives about, which means concerning. Just like one mimicking, say, Renoir in cinema early on. Gosh, there's no anagram indicators here. So I'm not sure how that clue is working. Closest human, perhaps, circling bull. No. Ones leaving perfect bargain. This is deal. Perfect is ideal. Ones leaving means remove the letter I, which looks like one. That leaves deal, which is a bargain. Presentation speech is holding record. Nope. Possibly flat pastry mistake over putting fruit in. Gosh, I wonder if this is pied de terre. Because a pied de terre is a flat, as in a property, an apartment. Pastry, mistake. Pastry could be pie. Mistake could be er. Uh, Putting fruit in. Well, we've got pie, we've got date, which is a fruit, and we've got er, uh, meaning mistake. But how does this word play work? Possibly flat is the definition. Pastry mistake over putting fruit in. Yeah, pastry is pie, mistake is er. Uh, over is a reversal indicator. That gives the last three letters of Pierre de Terre. Putting fruit in, putting date in. Presentation. Speech is holding record. Record is often EP for extended play, a type of gramophone record. Presentation. And then speech would be a seven-letter word beginning with D, not getting that. Mike invested in fuel. That's ridiculous. No, Mike could be M in the NATO phonetic alphabet, but that's all I'm getting. One new exam in English 
of which colon is a part. Well, could this be intestine? So one is I, new is N, the abbreviation. Exam is test, in is in, and English is E. And then an intest the intestine is or contains a colon as, as a part of it. So that is correct. Choral piece assembled around biblical texts. So the biblical texts are going to be NT or OT for New and Old Testament. And the definition is choral piece. So I think a motet is a choral piece. Assembled is met around biblical texts around OT. Mike, well, we've already considered that. In spite of being without status. Great, this is not with standing. So notwithstanding means in spite of. And then being without status is not with standing. Standing being a synonym for status. Now, surely four across. Presentation, speech, is holding record. What is this? Presentation, depiction, yeah. So depiction is presentation, speech is diction, holding record, holding EP. Now, ending in I, that looks good. Revolutionary is one, cutting food, plants. So, well, I'm not sure about this. It just fits the letter pattern. Narcissi is plural of Narcissus, which is a plant, so it could be plants. Revolutionary is a reversal indicator. So revolutionary is IS, one is I, cutting food plants, sorry, cutting food, cutting scran. Scran is a slang word for food. So that works. Ports initially, like Erith, but without river. Gosh, don't know. Mike invested in fuel. That's ridiculous. So I think this is comical. Mike is not M. It's M-I-C, the abbreviation for microphone. And Mike means my can mean microphone. Invested in fuel, put in coal. That gives comical, which means ridiculous. Now, 16 across. Ports initially like Erith, but without river. Wow. So, I think the definition is port. Initially like could be the initial letter of like, L. It could also, the initially could also apply to like and Erith, which would give L and E. Aha, uh -huh. the answer is Leith. So Leith, I think, is a port in Scotland. Initially, like is the initial letter of like. And then Erith, without river, is the whole of Erith, but without R, the abbreviation for river. Firm in Russian city concerning for Scotland. So... I think this is permanent. So permanent means firm. And I'm just hesitating because I need the Russian city to be perm, P-E-R-M. And I'm not confident about that. But Scottish for concerning is anent, which is just a Scottish word which means concerning or about. But I think if we get the P corroborated, then I'll be confident about the answer. Wrapping ground pepper with care. So I think wrapping is the definition. Ground is an anagram indicator for pepper and care. And I think that gives crepe paper. Let's have a look at these letters. We're looking for pepper with care. So P-E-P, -E -P, 
P-E-R. Yeah, we do have the right letters, so I think that's correct. Get browned off about theatre. That's boring. This is tree pan. So get browned off is tan. Although I'm not sure about the off. Get browned is certainly tan. About theatre, about rep. Rep is short for repertory, which is also short for repertory theatre. And a tree pan is an instrument for boring into the skull. So it's just this off which I'm slightly puzzled about. But why does tan mean browned off as opposed to just browned? Not sure about that, but I'm confident about the answer. Broadcasts, invitation to cheer, flyer. So broadcasts could be airs. Invitation to cheer. Yeah, hip. That's um, as in hip, hip, hooray. Why is that an invitation to cheer? Not quite sure about invitation there, but that gives airship, which is of something which flies. Short TV feature about northern tip. This is prong. A TV feature is a programme, so a short programme is a prog, short just referring to a shortened form of the word programme. About Northern, about N, the abbreviation for Northern, that gives prong, which is a tip. Body, that's downgraded, parking on most of airport. Gosh. So parking is P. On most of airport is going to refer to the remaining four letters. So the definition is body that's downgraded. Ah, well, Pluto was downgraded from a planet to something less, less illustrious than a planet. So parking is P on most of airport on most of Luton. Luton is an airport in Britain. Great, look at this letter pattern. Transported cup at holly for aromatic oil. This is patchouli. So transported is an, is an anagram indicator for cup at holly. And that gives patchouli, which is an aromatic oil. I am cut by the heartless couple. This is item. So I am is I'm. Cut by the heartless. Well, the heartless means take the word the and remove its heart. The letter H, that leaves T-E. So I am, I'm, cut by T-E, gives item, which is a couple, when referring to, to two people who are going out together. Problem with sister, getting in fake spirit. The spirit is surely rum, which means... The problem, problem is the definition, so I think we get conundrum. A conundrum is a problem. Sister is none. Getting in fake, getting in cod, spirit, rum. Fantastic, making good progress. Corresponding material in rubbish promos is rejected. Wow, not getting that. Last letters are not as helpful as initial letters, so where to now? Kuwait's capital. So we're looking for an anagram of K, Arabs are, and old. And that works with A, R, and E. And the whole thing means settlement. Just wondering what this final four letters could be. Can't see K being in either of those places. We've used up the whole of R. That just leaves Arabs and old. No, not getting that. OK, something to look forward to. Rambling on downs and upland. Rambling looks like an anagram indicator for on downs. 
Yes, and it is. That gives Snowdon, which is a mountain in Wales, therefore an upland. It turned dark, turning fearful. This is timid. So, it turned, turned is a reversal indicator for it. Dark is dim. Yes, and turning means turn dim. So we get it turned followed by dim turned, which gives timid, which means fearful. Fantastic. Hosts mooring on island. So island, I think, is going to be man because the Isle of Man, known as man, is an island off the coast of Britain. So the definition is host and we're looking for a six-letter word meaning mooring to put on top of man. Not getting that. Decapitated poets, killers. Gosh, this is really difficult. S, not helpful in a word which looks like it's defined as a plural. So, just not getting that. Corresponding material. Already considered that. Closest human, perhaps. Circling bull, question mark. I wonder if this is proximate. I think it is. So, closest human. Closest. Proximate, I think, means closest. Human, perhaps, is primate. Circling bull, circling ox. Fantastic. And that P could be helpful. Just like one mimicking. Yes, surely this is impressionistic. So, an impressionist is somebody who does impressions or mimics. So, impressionistic means just like one mimicking. And Renoir was an impressionist painter. So, say... Renoir, Impressionist, in cinema early on. How are we getting TIC from cinema early on? I'm going to come back to that. I'm not getting it. Let me do my very quick typo squiz. And I'm revisiting that in case there is an alternative answer, which I... I will get from the remaining clues if I can solve them. So all the acrosses look good, all the downs look good. Yep. So let's have a look at the remaining clues. One of two is either. I is one encountered in upper atmosphere, encountered in ether. Now we've still got the letters for Arabs are K and O. So what's left is Arab K O. And we're looking for a settlement. Not getting that. Decapitated poets, killers. Aha. Uh -huh. Well, orcas are killers because they're killer whales, and killer whales can be known as killers. And the poet is Lorca. L-O-R-C-A, Spanish poet, I think. So if we decapitate Lorcas, we're left with Orcas. Now, three clues to go. Corresponding material in rubbish promos is rejected. I'm just wondering if rejected... Well, I was going to say it's a reversal indicator, but I'm not getting that to work. Corresponding material. This could refer to material which is used for writing letters, like ink and something else. In, therefore, could be in. Not getting the rest, but does the C help with 15 down? Hosts, yes, I think it does. An anchor man is a host of a television show. So anchor man is hosts, mooring is anchor, on island, on man. Now, two orphan clues to go. 
corresponding material so it doesn't begin ink. In rubbish, promos is rejected. I think this is a hidden clue. And well done for to the setters for holding out. Hidden clues can be the easiest to get, but they do occasionally pop up as the final clues. So the in and the rejected tells us that the answer is contained within the intervening words when read backwards. And we're looking for a word which begins with I. So if we start with the I of is and read backwards, we can read isomorph. which is corresponding material. I guess I'm not familiar with the definition of that, but I'm confident that the answer is correct. So we're now left with A, R, B, K and O. And the whole thing is a settlement. 21 minutes down. Where is the K going to go? I'm, I'm, it may, I may be wrong in thinking it's an anagram of Arabs R, K and O. But I've no alternative way of approaching this and I don't feel I've exhausted this possibility so let me just check again the whole of R is accounted for S and A go so we're left with bar K and O what's this letter let me put those in alphabetical order A B K O R A B K possibly O R K is most likely a, B, O, R, not A. B, O, R. I'm really not feeling good about this at all. I would surely have heard of that. Don't like that whatsoever. Okay. I am struggling with this. Let me just check that I've got all the crossing letters correct. Impressionistic, Anchorman. Let me just check Chimera. There are two ways of spelling that. Chimera, anagram of Crimea. Yeah, could there be an anagram of Chimera? Which means also means monster? I don't think so, so that's correct. Crepe paper, wrapping ground pepper with care. Pep. P-E-P. P-E-R. These, these letters are right. And Pied de Terre is right. So everything here is right. Kuwait's capital is Kuwait City. So we're not looking for Kuwait's, for the capital city. Arabs are changing old settlement could the definition be old settlement do I have to use an O Arabs are changing old Settlement. And I tried Scarabro, which just looked awful. What if it began S double A B A Saba Crow, Saba Orc? These all just aren't ri ringing even remote bells. Arabs are changing. Old settlement. So I'm thinking of settlement as being a place. But it could be a financial settlement. Q 
Kuwait's capital. Well, if it is an anagram of Arabs are K and old, then the most interesting letter of those is K. So I've considered K here and came up with Scarabro. Nothing else fitted. What about K here? Sarkabro. No, what about K here? But then what would this letter, would this word be? K-R-A-E or O-E? No. And here it would be Ark or Ork. What about Ark? No. Well, I'm giving up on this because... Am I? I can't give up. Kuwait's capital. Arabs are changing. Old. Settlement. No. So... Wow. What a sad moment. I, I absolutely have no idea of this. Let me just check that I've got at least the right letters in. I haven't. I haven't. I don't need the O at all. Let me... Let me start again. I haven't been considering the correct letters. So we're looking for nine letters. There are eight letters in Arabs R plus K. So there's no O. So we're looking for bar and K. Bar and K. Surely the A, which is the only vowel, goes in in the second word. So we're now looking for bar, B-A-R. No, we're looking for B-R-K. Okay, I think I might have this. Because this looks vaguely Scottish, and bray is a Scottish word. 28 minutes down. Is this the correct letters? We've got R at the end, we've got A, R. These, these are the correct letters. These are the letters of Arabs, R and K. Nothing else works for these final four letters other than bray. Scara bray sounds a bit like scarpa flow. It sounds plausible. So that is a threadbare solve, but this is the best I can come up with. So every clue solved, every clue explained, just about. No empty squares. Submit. Submit. Hope and pray. No errors. Wow. Unbelievable. So I have never heard of Scara Bray. That means absolutely nothing for me. I think it took a little longer to, to come up with the guess of Scara Bray because I had it in mind that there was an O in the mix and there wasn't. So that caused some delay. But what a what a beautiful puzzle. Absolutely terrific stuff. Great fun. I love that. And there were several tricky clues. I think there were th two or three clues I didn't properly explain. So Scara Bray I've never heard of. And what were the other... I, th I know there were a couple of clues. I think browned off for... Got browned off for tan. I didn't understand what off was doing. And... I'm sure there was one other clue which I didn't have a full explanation for. Yeah, impressionistic. That's I, 
didn't remotely get... I was going to revisit Impressionistic, but I spent so long over Scarra Bray. Let me revisit it now. How can I do that? So I think I'll, I'll reset the puzzle and then have a look at one down. Oh, I can just look at one down. Just like one mimicking, say, Renoir. So the definition could go all the way to Renoir. No, because that wouldn't be a proper use of the word mimicking. So the definition is just like one mimicking. Say Renoir is impressionist. Aha, that just leaves IC. And then early on indicates the initial letters of in cinema. I was struggling at the time because I thought I was having to explain TIC. But after Impressionist, it's just IC, which are the initial letters of in cinema. So I think we're there. I think everything is explained. What a, a ragged solve. But sometimes it's it's like that, either because you're you're not on the right wavelength or just because you're battling difficult puzzles and the setters go out of their way to to make their puzzles challenging not impossible but challenging and this one certainly proved so so was it me or was it everyone what's the snitch going to be for this puzzle i think even the clues i got wrong were reasonably guessable so i'm going to to guess that the snitch is in the 70s or 80s Anyway, a super puzzle from the Times. I hope you enjoyed watching that solve. Like, comment and subscribe and I will see you next times.